this book, titled United Kingdom Journey, was written by Cleo Marini Benisa Simatipa and Zepin Nabasa Mateo Simatipa. Edinburgh, Scotland, Dynamic Earth. I love Dynamic Earth because it's so awesome and amazing. Inside the Dynamic Earth, there's lots of information about planets, gems, a time machine, and other things to see and learn. An excellent place for children to visit. We stayed at the Premier Inn, Edinburgh Park. The hotel is clean and has a good restaurant, where they serve the famous English breakfast for us. Oh yeah, I forgot to let you know in the beginning of this story about my little brother. Do you see my baby brother in this photo below? His name is Eldrian Moses Scotlander Sematupang, and Scotland is the first country that he visited. Do you think we already look like a Scottish in this family photo? Glasgow, Scotland. We had a ride on the big bus to go around Glasgow City. I like the weather over there because it is cool. There are a lot of nice places to visit, such as museums. In Glasgow, I had the experience to use a metal detector, like the army used to sweep for landmines. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell button. Now, let's continue reading. Manchester. In Manchester City, we went to Manchester Museum, and there we saw some mummies, sarcophagus, and dinosaur fossils. I was amazed to see these things, because I have only seen them in books and on television, but now I have seen them for real, with my own eyes. In Manchester, there are a lot of old buildings. I do not really like to see all these old buildings, but I do like to see inside them, especially inside this museum. It is cool, and there is a lot of history that we can learn from them. Liverpool. I also went to Liverpool City and visited the Albert Dock. I saw some owls and seagulls nesting in the dock buildings. I think Liverpool is a clean city. We also enjoyed the park inside the Liverpool One. We had a picnic with my family there. London. After Liverpool City, we went to London City. We used a version train from Manchester train station to London train station. I am a lucky little girl because the train driver let me go to his control cabin, and I pretended that I am the driver of this train. We went to Big Ben, London Bridge, Tower Bridge, Tower of London, and to many more tourist places. We had a ride on a Thames riverboat to see the London city from the riverside. There is a monument called Cleopatra's Needle near to Victoria Embankment. My father says that this obelisk belongs to me. What a funny dad. Salisbury. We also went to Stonehenge on a visit. This is one of the oldest prehistoric monuments in England. I do not know what the stone statues are for. The stones are erected upright with many other big stones surrounding it. And the funny thing is, they are in the middle of a meadow. My father says that the reason for these stones still remains a mystery, and nobody knows for sure why these stones were erected here, which is far from where the people live. We really enjoyed the UK trip, as it has given us a lot of memories and stories to tell. It's time now to travel back to our home in Abu Dhabi. Our plan is to fly with Qatar Airways on a Boeing 380 double-decker plane and is the biggest passenger plane in the world today. We will depart from Heathrow Airport. My father says it is one of the biggest airports in the world. We had a safe flight and arrived home with a lot of stories to tell to my friends and families. See you again in our next story. Hit the bell, like, comment, and share. Thank you.